going on Domination fans? This is the Game Hunter channel with a new episode of Let's Play Domination. And we're going to start with a replay of course. This is the new layout of my base. I've been making some quick changes which we're going to analyze in a few more seconds. And uh, let's see where these guys are coming. I don't even know. Okay. Okay. Anytime. Oh, there you go. They're coming from that area. Let's see. They brought down one of the, the entrance. And I got all my bunkers, catapult, Coliseum coming in this area. I think, I think this defensive building, the defensive layout is working okay so far for me. Even though there is a lot of archers in there. Those archers are a problem. The good thing is that I had a catapult. Yeah, I had a catapult. Attacking those guys big time. And, um, hmm. Not too bad. Not too bad. Let's see if, uh, what, what was the destruction level. And how much loot they were able to get. Those are oh, those are just gonna go down in two more, probably one or two more. This uh, catapult and the Coliseum is bringing me more and more reinforcement. Hey, that was pretty good. That was really good. Six percent destruction. I'll take that for now. Um, let's go. Yeah, you didn't get much loot to be quite honest. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. Okay, so well, the idea of the let me let me probably I need to, oh okay, I need to start upgrading those traps. So the idea of this uh, layout is to keep the Colosseum in the middle. The Colosseum is the one that is providing me with reinforcements. One of the buildings that is providing me with reinforcements. So it's definitely important for me to keep this one in the middle, okay? Because otherwise, with the previous layout, people were getting so comfortable destroying destroying my. Uh, my Coliseum and after that it was really difficult for me to get some extra reinforcement plus plus the my garrisons and more, my stables were really separated they, they weren't actually working together I mean if somebody was attacking me for one area of the map the stables and the garrison reinforcement were taking forever to get there so it was just a waste so I decided to come out with this little base which is working really good for me everything centralized Coliseum in the middle I got my town center over here too to provide some support. Um, really important these ballista towers. Okay, they, they're really not the best, but against heavy cavalry, woo, they are monsters, monster, monster. They can destroy the heavy cavalry like like butter. Okay, so definitely a unit, a, a building that you need to have. That's why they have to. I decided to put these ballista towers behind the garrison okay because usually the heavy cavalry is the one that's gonna start the attack the heavy cavalry is the one that's gonna be in front of you um, trying to receive all the hit points right when you start attacking so what happened that probably heavy cavalry is gonna get really entertaining destroy my garrison and staple and in the meantime I got the ballista tower over here taking care of them as we saw in the previous replay right so that is exactly the idea of this uh, layout I got the catapults in which one in each side of the the Coliseum doing some decent job. Like I said, I'm gonna continue testing this uh, um, layout before making another video or defensive. I, I, the only problem is that I now I'm using a lot more walls and I need to upgrade them. Yeah, there's a, there a, a lot of weak spots in here, for example, and over here that I need to reinforce as soon as possible. So one of my new missions is to upgrade all my walls as high as possible. Okay. Uh, the other thing, well, the layout is working okay. I got most of the buildings connected. So the the goal that I'm getting from the road is actually pretty good. I love it. Uh, there is a couple of buildings that are, of course, not part of this. But as long as long as I have, I'm getting attacked in the Star Wars Commander, come on, just give me a break. Come on, I'm playing Domination now. Get out. Thank you. Um, as long as I have the, the Stonehenge um most of the other buildings connected, so it's, it's pretty good. I mean, most of the buildings are connected. It's probably just... This uh, barracks over here, um, probably these houses in here that are not connected to the road. But uh, you know what? I'll take that. It's not. It's not like a big deal. Actually, I don't know if I can do this. No, you know, I was trying to come up with something new. Oh, wait, I'm not gonna innovate right now. Um, the good thing is that this area is really tight. Okay, you see, it's still, it's still a forest in here. So if somebody tried to deploy units, the units are gonna get extremely close to the walls. That's how and when my catapult will take care of business, right? And also I got some towers in each corner. Probably this tower can be... Uh, the reason that it's in the corner is because, like I said, there's not much room in there to deploy, so I'm counting that they wouldn't be able to 
uh, attack these enemies, especially if they're melee characters. I should be able to stop them with this tower. Uh, probably could pay, I can put the market in that corner and leave the, the tower in a more centralized position. That would be a good idea, but at the same time, I'm taking the risk that somebody's going to try to steal the market just with a couple archers, right? A couple archers. If I put this one in the location of the tower, they can just deploy a bunch of archers in here and steal all my gold. And that is exactly what we're trying to avoid, right? I, I don't really care about the medals at this point. I really care about protecting my resources. All right, so the next stuff is the castle. Remember I mentioned to you guys about the castle? That is such an important building because you can create generals. Um... And it's also an old defensive building. So I'm definitely doing this one. I finally was able to get all the food that I need. Which is a lot. It's like 150,000. But uh, it's going well. One more day. And probably in the next episode. We're going to see these new generals in action. And all the stuff. Uh, we have some new troop. Which we're going to use in this episode. Now that we have the blacksmith level 5. We have access to. Uh, well that is, that's not the bombardment. I'll show you right now which one it is. Because it's the previous one. The ballista. Which has another name. Oh, Ballista. Okay. So we got the Ballista. Heavily damaged buildings from range. Uh, it's really weak because the enemy... If you have any close... Um, close enemies close to the... Close or close or close or close. <laughs> the Ballista by itself cannot protect itself. You need to have some archers surrounding the Ballista. Or probably some Phalanx. Um, because... Well, I don't have Phalanx anymore. I think they're called... Oh, yeah, Phalanx. I need to upgrade those guys. Um, really powerful, but if you get enemies too close to it, it's dumb. It's dumb. Um, really expensive, five thousand in food, and troop space is ten. So, again, really important to protect it. So let's use this cat up with ballista in this episode. That is part of the. So yeah, trying to do like a this updates uh, episode so you can show you all the changes that I'm making in my base, all the progress, what I'm building now. Because uh, that's why it looks like people love seeing this. Uh, and I enjoy doing it too. So that's why we're going to uh, use this ballista. And test this on the battlefield. Tricky. I, I don't know the range of the ballista. I haven't used it yet. So this is going to be the first time. Uh, but that doesn't mean that we... Oh, okay. This space is kind of strange. You know, if, you, if you're going for, for points, I mean for medals, this is a really easy one. Because the... The town center is right there outside, so such an easy target. But that's not what I care. Not like I say, I'm not looking for a for. Ooh. I'm not really looking for medals at this point. Oh, this is building a castle too. Interesting. I see that the catapult is right here. Reinforcements are quite close, so I don't like it. But um, oh, the castle is over there. Oh, nasty. Nasty. Wow. I need, to, I need to get more more heavy cavalry probably to get in this one. So let's be a little more selective. Uh, protecting the Pantheon instead of the town center. Oh, that's the town center. No, that's not the town center. Are you upgrading town center? What is this? I'm confused. What is this? Okay, this is similar to my base. Really similar to my base. Wow. Interesting. Protecting a garrison from there. Um, oh, those garrisons are level, high level. They're high, high level. Okay, what we can do, we can actually deploy um, some of this Shukanu over here. we we'll put the Ballista. Providing some extra support. Reinforcements are coming, so we need to be careful and ready. Now that, the, now that we got some reinforcement coming, we're going to put the Phalanx to attack the cavalry. I don't want to deploy yet the, the heavy. Oh, yeah, heavy cavalry move. Oh, but list is going down. No, 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 no. I'm still alive. That is good. That is good. Destroy that. Protect the ballista. Oh, ballista went down. Oh, it's like, oh, but is still alive. Perfect. So now it's the turn of the miner. We're gonna protect, heal our troops. The power of the Coliseum. And hopefully, we'll be able to get inside this base. Town center destroy. Perfect. Ballista is doing quite okay. Look at that. He's shooting from distance, big time. Wow. I'm so surprised. What is the range of the Ballista? Ooh, baby. Oh, no, no, no. What I did? Oh, I pressed this from bottom. Oh, that wasn't the plan. But still, you know what? It's a good idea to keep all my troops together. So, not really complaining. 
Now we need to destroy that catapult because that catapult is gonna. Oh, Ballista destroyed the catapult in one shot. That was amazing. Amazing. Oh, <laughs> loving this. Loving this so far, guys. Wow. Okay, the idea now, if we still stay, try to stay together, guys. All right, any chances? Any chances to just. No, no, just. I'm not trying. I'm not asking for too much. I just wanna make sure that we can all keep together in here as a family. Shikunus are taking care of the infantry and the ballistas in. Perfect, Ballista is shooting from this, and let's see if we can... Oh, if we can destroy that catapult, that would be awesome. Let's see if we can destroy it. Oh, wow, one shot! One shot is just amazing! Wow, those Ballistas are very powerful! Wow, okay, that was a really interesting episode then. I wasn't sure it was that powerful. Look at that, it's bringing down defensive um, buildings like nothing. It's just destroying, destroying at this point. 60% destruction, not bad. Uh, my Chikunus are able to destroy those uh, infantry reinforcements. They're no match for my Chikunu. Um, again, every civilization has some powerful units. Uh, I believe the most powerful unit in the game is the Samurai, which that's the reason I didn't want to play with the Japanese. I don't want to uh, just abuse Samurais, and I know a lot of people do that. Um, again, that, that is fine. That is the more powerful unit. But my Chikunu works really good against infantry. Really good. Wow, look at that ballista. Look at that ballista going. Isn't that crazy? Wow. And my group of Chikunus are still moving forward, trying to destroy the garrison. Um, and those reinforcements are coming this way. Ooh. I'm really happy with this ballista. I got a new favorite unit. Extremely, extremely powerful. Wow. Nice, that was a really good attack. And we got a domination bonus, one diamond. Perfect. We lost a... Oh, somebody destroyed the ballista. Oh. That is so sad. Really? Somebody come back? Yes! My fearless. Oh, this is the my reinforcement, my... How do you call it? My mercenaries. Where's my chicken news? I'm supposed to receive some chicken news back, no? I got a bunch of solid de Subai. Where are those guys? Where are those guys? No? Really? Uh, is that a new feature that now my troops are not coming back home? No? It's not coming home? Really? Wow, I'm surprised. That is strange. Usually I got my reinforcements back. I mean, all the troops had to survive. Okay. Okay, all right. Okay, not complaining. Whatever it is, it is. No problem. War Academy. This is another thing that I need to upgrade. Because, um... What? I think I'm already used the first kit. What is going on? That is strange. I lost my troops. I still got all the the tactics with me. Mm. It is what it is. Okay. We're going to get two ballistas this time. Uh, we're going to get two of these cataphracts protecting. Probably three. I don't have room. Oh, yeah, I have room. And now we're going to get a bunch of elite Shukanu. Maybe I need some phalanx to protect against the. Hey, this is gonna be interesting. I will probably get a wall break, wall miner. Oh, we're not gonna get a wall miner. That's okay. I want to see these ballistas in action one more time. Deadly, deadly. They destroy everything in two seconds. So I can't wait to get the bombardment. Then the bombard is the upgrade version of the. Of the ballista, I think I cannot upgrade this one until the gunpowder. Yeah, it makes sense. It, it makes sense because the the ballista, the bombard is has to be in the gunpowder era. Okay, you cannot have that in the medieval. Come on, come on. I like I like the fact that they're they're careful with those little details. Okay, surrender, so defender, and we continue getting some. There's more free crowns. No, free crowns, free crowns, everybody, free crown. Okay, Have some crowns. My goals are fine. Okay, let's go to the next attack. Really enjoying my new unit, Ballista. Powerful, powerful unit from distance. Um, well, there's not much loot in this one. Let's see what do we have in here. I'm still concerned why I didn't get my troops back. What happened in there? Why I didn't get my troops back? Something really fishy happening. And uh, look at that. I'm, I'm still, I still have the first kit, and I'm already used the first kit, right? Am I right or am I wrong? Because I, I'm, I'm sure that I'm, I'm positive that I use 
the first kid in the previous attack so it doesn't make sense oh, okay well i'll take it anyway all right this is this is, was one of my memes my mistakes in the previous layout see the coliseum's right there so it's really easy it's a really easy target if you destroy the coliseum say goodbye to all that precious bonus of reinforcement okay this is a really strange base i don't know why you're trying to protect my friend because hello breaking news they can attack you from here <laughs> in case you haven't figured that out um again let's try to see if we can get a little more loot medieval age uh this one looks interesting i'm not sure what will be the best way to attack oh we can attack from here yeah bring down that coliseum as fast as possible okay let's give it a shot to this one the level of the walls over here are really low oh but oh, both catapults are really vulnerable perfect because we're gonna put the ballistas in here and we're gonna protect this with the chikonus okay try to keep the chikonus as close as possible and then we can put the heavy cavalry perfect perfect let's, let's, let's destroy these guys and then we target the catapult nice we're gonna deploy the first kit and now let's use the power of the coliseum one more time i have no idea why i have that but uh i'll take it and let's use the reinforcement oh my ballistas are going down oh, but these are still alive perfect protect my ballistas guys this is the most precious 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 building oh catapults are went down wow that was a really quick attack we both down the base in two seconds and my mercenaries are taking care of the rest with my chikunus in the back providing some support deadly deadly attack ballistas wow amazingly powerful new favorite unit ever I'm gonna take a picture of these ballistas so it's gonna be part of my thumbnail when I finish this episode okay we get the ballistas in there moving forward over there let's see awesome awesome and the chikunus are perfect because they're protecting the the ballistas perfectly right Okay, let's see if we can get the troops together one more time. They're shooting everywhere, so it would be nice. Destroy that mill over there. Perfect. Let's see if we can destroy the reinforcement building. Ballistas are bringing down the walls really fast too, so I don't know if... I, I'm not sure if I'm going to need the, the miner anymore. The wall breaker unit. Because these guys are really powerful. Wow, one shot. Ooh, careful! Look at those towers! Those towers destroyed... Oh, that was such a bad move! Now I lost both towers. <laughs> both ballistas. Which is okay. Which is alright. But lo look at that tower. It's bringing down everything in one shot. Interesting. Wow! Didn't know it was that deadly. But, okay. I got two... Two of my phalanx in steel. On the battlefield, there's nothing else to destroy. Nah, let's get out of here. Yes. I just want to see if I'm going to save and have those uh, phalanx back when I go home. I'm supposed to, right? Because uh, I didn't, uh, those guys survive. Where are these guys? Are coming back? Oh. Hmm. Is that a new feature? Now that we don't we don't receive our troops back after attacking? No? Yes? Maybe? All right. Well. <laughs> All right, everybody. This is the Game Hunter signing off a good, nice episode of Dominations. Um, ballista extremely extremely powerful get that as soon as possible it's going to help you a lot in offense so i will see you in the next episode take care everybody <laughs>